What's up guys? I think we finally fixed the mic. Wow, for some reason I forgot. Choke is all the way down, not all the way up. That feels better. All right. I was scared there for a second. I'm like, why does it keep fogging on me? That feels better. So note to self, make sure to choke is off before you go out for a ride. Okay then. So we're back on the Hawk. Eagle Street, Eagle Street, lightning, lightning. I think I finally figured out the mic issue. And it's been so annoying. So what I ended up doing was I just bought a, a, a different sock, like a newer sock, like a bigger sock basically. And uh, I think it's fixed. I think it's fixed. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed it's fixed. That's a nice little road right here. So I wanted to give a shout out to the, the guy that commented on my last video. Uh, he's getting a new Hawk. Definitely, if you have it on the way already, if you ordered the Hawk already, just go ahead and buy a jet kit for it because you don't need it. But other than the jet kit, I mean, it's kind of up to you in terms of like the mods that you want to do. But the jet kit's a must. These things are too lean from the factory. Like you literally, uh, kind of what I was doing today, where if you go and give it gas, it'll just bog down and, and kill and die on you. That's uh, essentially what'll happen if you just don't jet it yet. Please don't pull out in front of me. Thank you. Oh my God, dude. What the heck? Snap, crackle, pop. I need a uh, gas. Nobody here waves at, nobody on a Harley. That's like the third guy on a Harley that hasn't waved on me. So yeah, we'll go get some go juice. We'll go get some air in the tires. And then uh, I know a couple roads here that are really nice to ride. We'll try to get some good riding vids in. A lot of you wanted riding vids because uh, my last video was bad with the audio quality. And I did promise y'all some more vids. So here I am. What the heck is that? What do you guys put in the Hawk? I just put 87. I did put 80, 93, but uh, I felt like it was just, it wasn't running right. So I put 87 and it felt a lot better. Typically I would run like a higher octane fuel on a small engine like, like, like this, but I don't know, it seemed like the 87 better. Dude, that is an awesome paint job on that truck. Back on. Oh, there we go.
love this. He is on the wrong side of the road. People just don't know how to drive today. What the? What is going on? I, I know a lot of people would turn around and like, but there's no point. The best you can do is like, you know, I was prepared to go. I was prepared to dodge it. The only thing you can do as a biker, really. I mean, you can yell at people all you want, that's not going to do anything. People are just so stupid. But I was prepared to dodge it completely. Like, I had I had a gateway plan. That's the only thing you, as a biker, you need to be concerned with. If you're concerned with just yelling at the dude and turning around and, and basically road rage, if you, that's the only thing you're concerned with, you're going to get in an accident. You're going to get hurt. You need to be, the only thing you need to be concerned with is how to get out of that situation. You need to be evaluating everything. And every little area that you can get through to avoid that accident, that's where you need to be paying attention to. Maybe we won't go that way. Ooh, okay. Again, you guys are killing it. I got more subscribers just uh, one video ago. I got like three new subscribers, so you guys are awesome and I love it. And uh, I love you all and uh, keep it up. I'm having so much fun making these videos, and uh, if you guys are liking them, then I'll keep making them. So, is there any other hawk riders out there in uh, the Florida area? I know I found a page, but it looks like you guys are from everywhere, even from like other countries. So, if anybody's in Florida and wants to do a little meetup, just let me know. We'll try to organize something. Oh, these these tracks are really bumpy. That was pretty cool. He, uh, he gave me a nod. That was a cool bike too. I, I didn't know the city of Okoye had bikes like that. Hopefully it doesn't come behind me because I really want to ride this road. Somebody asked me what my dream bike is, because obviously, I mean, they assumed that my dream bike wasn't a Hawk 250. <laughs> so yeah, my dream bike is probably going to be, right now I'm in between the KTM 390 Duke, the Honda CRF 250 Rally, and then the XR Honda 6, uh, XR 650L from Honda. I really like those three bikes right now. They really interest me. I also like the adventure bikes like the Royal Enfield, Himalayan, and that uh, CSC like RX3 or RX4. Those are pretty interesting too, but for like what I like to do, I think I like the, the Dual Sport or the, the KTM, which is like a Supermoto Street Fighter thing. I, so I don't know. I, those are my three favorite bikes. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Someone turn, please. Somebody turn. I just need one person to turn with me. One person, I thought you were going to do it. Yes! Oh, you're the best. Oh, you're the best. Oh, yeah. We got to trigger this light, buddy. Let's do it. I did forget to mention something in my last video. 
Uh, I did put a 17 tooth front sprocket on it. That's it. Stock, it's got the stock rear sprocket, but a 17 tooth in front. Uh, it just gives you a little bit better like uh, cruising speed at like at speed limits, basically. Oh, nice a little Lamborghini. too busy to go riding and have fun right now so pretty good video I want to check in on you plus I wanted to test this mic out because it's been giving me a pain it was it has been a pain to get this thing working Anyway, that's it, y'all. Uh, thanks, you guys, for stopping in again and watching the video. Uh, it'd be super dope if you smash that like button. And then uh, I'll catch you in the next one. All right? Peace. Forgot I, don't have, I forgot I didn't have a six gear. <laughs> I tried to shift up to a six gear, and I didn't have a six gear. <laughs> I thought I... <laughs> Somebody wanted a sound clip of it. I don't know if I can get a good sound clip of the bike. We'll try.